All right, I got it all back together. Looks real good. I pumped it full of about one tube of the John Deere corn grease. And it looks pretty high. I read somewhere, somebody said they take about, I don't know, two and a half or so. Um, but they also said that you gotta be careful because uh, it's hard to tell when it fills because what'll happen is if you're pumping it, it could start going up into the shaft. And uh, if you lose track of how much you put in there, you might start having it pour out of the, um, the hole for the horn wire. Um, so I put the steering wheel on, I've been working it back and forth. I'm gonna let it sit for a while. I'll let it sit overnight or a couple days whenever I get back to it. And it, it should sink down. It's a self-leveling grease, they call it. So it'll, it's supposed to spread back, um, back down. Let gravity pull it down, and then I'll add some more tomorrow. I got to review the manual on how to set these, but you know, you got your lash adjuster here, and then you've got tension adjuster where you uh, turn that big nut, tighten up the bearings. I forget the exact order, but if you do one, you always have to do the other. And uh, they have a procedure you need to put a little hook scale on the end of the steering wheel, and uh. It should take a pound and a half of pressure to keep it moving, I believe is what it said. And you tighten, you adjust these until you reach that. I don't remember off the top of my head, but I'll grab the book and review it again and walk through doing that. But for now, I'll just let it sit. Got my nice new gaskets, my nice new stainless steel bolts. Looks really nice. All right, more to come. Thanks.